Hello guys, welcome to the Unity Expert channel. Actually, welcome back. Today we're going to be learning all about Auto Moderator. This tool is extremely useful because instead of having a 30 man team, you can size down to about 10 people maybe, and then you'll have Auto Moderator doing most of the work for you. So as you remember last time, we made this fish business server. We're going to go into server settings. We're going to scroll down onto safety setup auto mod this is what you will be met with you can have blocking words from uh, profile usernames so people can't put in specific words in their username you can block potential spam block suspected spam content and block commonly flagged words and then block custom words usually i wouldn't use this unless you don't allow profanity at all so if you don't allow swear words curse words you can set this up but usually i like to make custom uh, words since this allows more uh, leeway for what I'm allowed and not allowed to you know say in the server so first things first you'll set up the block uh, mention spam this is just so people don't you know keep spamming people with pings so we'll set this to about a maybe like four so more than four they'll be blocked and we're actually going to have to create a new channel uh, discord Auto mod. This is a text, a private channel, only admins and moderators can see it. We'll edit it, permissions, advanced, and we will allow, we will remove from at everyone to be able to manage messages, read message history, manage threads. This is just so your mods aren't able to delete any messages in here because if i remember correctly you can delete uh, these alerts so just in case you know if it ever happens that they have access to deleting the records we won't allow it. it's just so if anyone's you know power hungry power tripping we won't allow this stuff and just so you can always have like a record of what everyone says because we will make it so every time they send something into the chat and it gets blocked uh it gets sent into here as a reminder so we go back into auto mod uh, here here and then we're gonna set up the block suspected spam content if a message is suspected of being spam you block the message and then we send an alert to uh discord auto mod save and we save that boom if anything is suspected to be spam uh, by discord's algorithm it will get sent into there We'll set up the custom block words and before we start adding words, we'll just explain. So here you'll add the words. You can either add them based out with a comma. So for example, shit, there, like that, or you do it like this, right? If you want to add, let's say auto, right? You can have, you can add an asterisk at the beginning and or at both ends and what this means is, for example, if you want to add this, right, words like auto moderator and autopilot will be flagged, but things like my auto or send auto, like these words, where auto is at the end of the word or end of the message, it will not get flagged. Same way, if you do this, if auto is at the end of the message or end of the word, then it will be flagged. If it's at the beginning, like autopilot, it won't flag. And if you want it to always flag the word, no matter what, where it is in the word, where it is in the message, you put an asterisk on both sides. So it flags every single message that has this in it, right? So we have also regex, if I'm saying this correctly. Uh, this is very advanced and you don't, you usually don't need this. Uh, this is like fully automate the server, but if you don't know how to, how to use this, then it might be very hard for you to implement it. Usually I would go, uh, I would skip this part myself. Anything that doesn't get flagged by auto mod, we have moderators for it, right? But if you want to learn how to do this, I suggest looking up a video tutorial on how to do uh, regex and uh maybe using ai's help like ChatGPT and stuff like that to uh, generate patterns for you to copy paste into uh, into this box but usually i just skip this because i personally don't need it 
allowed words and phrases this is basically just for in case your auto mod is false flagging a lot so uh, whatever word that's getting uh, falsely flagged by auto mod as a bad word you can add it into here and then it will just ignore it uh, that way you can just you know fix your auto mod so it perfectly matches what you want because sometimes words here especially if you use the wild cards like the asterisks at the beginning front or both sometimes they flags they flag things that aren't really supposed to be flagged so this just allows you to fix it now for the response you can have all three you can have one of each so this blocks the message so what if they send a message into the server that has the word it will not even send it will completely be blocked and it will show them that it was blocked you send an alert so discord automod and you can even temporarily time out your uh, your uh, server members usually i don't do this because i like to handle it ourselves but if you want you can time them out for 60 5 uh, 60 seconds 5 minutes and you know up to a week if you really want to and then you can also allow certain roles or channels to not be detected by automod usually i don't do this because the words we automod they don't really need to be used by anyone so i don't do this but people with admin and managed server permissions are always excluded so if, if um, you have roles that have administrator or managed server they will be able to say all words at all times no matter what we save this oh yes one keyword we'll just put cat save this and then you can create more you can create as many custom word blocks as you want i think um, and each one can fit up to a thousand words right so you should you should be fine to create as many as you need now for the uh, profile names it was basically the same thing so you add your keywords it's a thousand you can use uh, regex patterns uh, you can allow certain phrases in case it's blocking things that shouldn't be blocked and then you can block member interactions so they won't be able to use text voice uh, message like texting joining voice channels etc so they will be blocked out of the entire server basically and you can send an alert as well and you can allow certain roles again same thing now if you want you don't have to have just one channel if you want you can have a channel for each section to make it um more organized for yourself and yeah that's basically everything you need to know about uh, automod uh, it's a very good tool i suggest every server at least try it out because it makes it so much easier to deal with people who just want to say slurs they want to just be toxic stuff like that so yeah i appreciate you guys joining us for this video and hopefully we can go back to making you know more videos for you guys just to teach you everything you need to know about discord